Dog was abandoned in a dumpster and left for dead. Thankfully, it was rescued by garbage men who saw it just in the nick of time. News Channel 8's John Rogers joins us now live from Manatee County with some of these shocking pictures. Good evening, guys. An absolutely shocking story indeed. The dog was found in a dumpster behind the speedway off of State Road 64, and I'm told these garbage men were thankful that the lid was open because otherwise this would have been a tragic story. Just before 3.45 on Monday, a waste management truck arrived at the speedway. It was a typical job on the route. Just empty out these dumpsters and leave. But one piece of garbage stood out. I saw a little head pop up. So that's when I ran around and I, you know, and I saw the puppy in there and I yelled at Oriole. I said, Oriole, there's a dog in that dumpster over there. And he goes, dead? And I says, no, she ain't dead. She's much alive. She is a six-month-old female pit bull mix. She had simply been discarded along with her crate. The dog was frightened and very thirsty. The men believe she may have been there for hours. For anyone to do something like that, that that's, that, it's, to me, it's a sin. <laughs> uh, you can do that to a person. You know I mean, you have no, no care for life. The dog did not bark and followed commands. The men could have easily missed her. Because once she gets in the truck and we start packing it, that could have been the end of it. The pit bull was not microchipped but it's in good health and is recovering at Manatee County Animal Services. These garbage men are always on the lookout for suspicious activity, but they never could have imagined this. That's a life that was in there, and it was, I mean, it was, and the dog was so beautiful. If you could talk to the owner that did this, what would you say? I don't think I could say that on a camera. Animal abandonment is a crime punishable by a first-degree misdemeanor. If you have any information to help in this case, contact Manti County Animal Services. Live in Manti County tonight, John Rogers, News Channel 8.